So apparently, we got some more stuff to watch. Cyberpunk 2077, a whole 25 minutes of gameplay that they uploaded. Well, not they, as in CD Projekt Red. Uh, but we got gameplay footage, I guess B-roll footage, the uh, developers, journalists got. Anyway, I don't care how they got it. It's online, it's on YouTube. 25 minutes of gameplay that we have not seen yet. I gotta watch it. Let's do it right now, I'm gonna shut up, and then we'll talk about it afterward like I always do. Let's get to it. Okay, let's do it. That's a dope ass car. First of all, <laughs> that's a dope ass car. I've been wanting to see how the driving works too. Go to Lizzie's bar. You get street cred just for driving fast? That's what's up. I'm really trying to check out the handling. See, that was a little loose there because that handgun's going up. Damn, why is stuff just going up for driving around? But this world, damn. Absolutely incredible. The details. Oh, we skip. Oh, what the? Okay. Nice change of pace. From what I read, this is uh, the Nomad path, right? In the beginning of the game, where you could choose between Corpo, Nomad, and uh, Street Kid. This is the Nomad beginning. You got to drive your way into Night City. And all that stuff affects how you play the game, which I like. Choices, paths, uh, consequences, all that stuff is awesome. I like that. Okay, this is a weird kind of cut going on. Save the monk. I'm really in uh, interested, like I said, to just feel how it, how it feels to drive, how you grip to the road, the handling of it. This is an odd cut. But, uh. You're gonna tell me what happened back there. Okay, dialogue. <laughs> Let's say I have a bad feeling about this. Oh. Happened a lot to you? Rarely. Smelling trouble around the bend? Drive, Jackie, just drive. <laughs> And from what I read too, Jackie will be in your life regardless of what uh, path you choose in the beginning. But it affects what point you meet Jackie and how you know him and interact with him a little bit. So. You are transporting contraband that is corporate property. I repeat, stop the car. Okay, so this is still the Nomad too. I see it on the screen. Nomad path. Light him up. Mm. I like the gun sound. Is he just missing shots? <laughs> Hit that man. <laughs> Car about to blow up. That's a heavy hand cannon. I like that. I like that. This is sick. Where's the ammo at? I must be. I forgot. That's a uh, a uh, damn. I forget the word. A mod that you could put like on your hand that actually starts showing you ammo and stuff, which I like too. Hmm. Beautiful. Jackie not a bad driver, from what we could tell. Don't die, V. You're not a dick. No, they didn't just show me an ad. Oh, this is the corporal beginning? Got you, okay. So that's why they split it up like that. landing site has been detected at the destination. Find a spot close to the bar, as close as you can. Fuck procedures. <laughs> corporal don't give a damn. Lizzie's bar, huh? 
Corporal Rat. I see why they split it up like that now. It was weird, but fuck it, whatever. Showing the Corpo Nomad and Street Kid path, like I've talked about already. I do like how you can fly, by the way. Airborne vehicles, finally seen that. That basketball moves so fast. Keep an eye on the AV for me, will you? See, I would have said here on business. I wasn't asking. I'm not a scratch on it when I get back. Sound like a dick? Yeah, I wouldn't have picked that answer. But that's cool though, you can do whatever you want. Pick to say whatever you want, consequences to come with it. I can't say it enough. I love that about this game. Ooh, dope. Love the colors, the scenery. One of the most amazing things about Cyberpunk is you can get immersed in this entirely new world. Like top to bottom, it's just a incredible looking world. This is super interesting. Then Jackie. Good to see you too, Jack. How you been? And then back to save the monk. This is some. The the cuts are weird. The the cuts are weird. I see what they're trying to do though. Show you the different. The different ways to go about it or whatever. But we just saw this earlier. <clears throat> Like how you can just make them overheat. Hacking is gonna be fun in this game. Hacking is gonna be fun. Nice nade. Yeah, see it down there in the right hand corner. This person has the uh, the mod upgrade. You can see the ammo. So this oh, that's a female V too. She took the juice. I forget what it's actually called. I like this gun too. The jumping is weird for me, but so, like that's weird. Why can you jump like that? Shit! The Manus Blades. <laughs> God damn. Is that like a tech thing too? A tech upgrade or mod? Why they just... The jump seems so floaty. I don't really like... But if that's a thing... For your legs or a mod then... I had to find a better link. We back. Just had to find a little better link that wouldn't get... Uh, interrupted by so many ads. Alright. Get to see yourself in the mirror a little bit. Electric coupling module. You said it was nothing serious when I came in. You said you were sure. Guess I was wrong. Can always look for another shop huh. where they won't ask a lone nomad why he's hugging the border. <laughs> That's fine. Step aside. Check my own what? engine, fool. Got any Put some right out the way. Do? I do want to know if uh mm. I'll bypass a couple of things. Huh. I'm gonna bypass the couple um, If you can change the skin color. I haven't really looked into that much. I'm gonna have to do that uh, soon. Just to see if that's something you could do too with character creation. I know there's a lot of other options, but yeah. But this is cool though. I hope this extends itself into like actual uh, car customization, which I'm pretty sure you'll probably be able to do. I don't know if we know that for sure though, but I would think so. 
We've obviously seen a bunch of different cars, so that's my assumption that you'll be able to customize cars. That'll get me to Night City. I'll figure something else out there. Is that a cop? Hey, yes, it is. You had a customer. Uh, rolled in a few hours past. I, I, I thought it at least called in. Don't you swear to mine. We're going to hash it out. Time to make some real decisions right now. Don't you know you owe the sheriff a word when you pay his town a visit? To tell him what's brought you here. Maybe even over a cup of coffee. Nah. No need to worry. I won't be staying long. Didn't answer my question now, did you? I would have punched him. <laughs> like, if you don't get up off my car. <laughs> Let's just assume in that, in that cut right there, that's what I did. This is odd cuts, though, man. We keep seeing the same stuff. Whoever put this 25 minutes of footage together, uh, it's not exactly, not exactly uh, put together all that well. Well, I'm glad to have footage regardless. God damn, like why? Okay. Street kid time. Disable the lack using current Let's take this piece of wonder tech for a world. You're a man of little faith. Stealing cars, huh? Hmm. Looks like this will be a cool breeze. The Rayfield. That's a nice name for a car, too. That sounds dope. I hear something. Get the fuck out. <laughs> Jackie's everywhere. Okay. Easy. Can't get away from Jackie. Nothing personal, go by. Just biz. Rayfield's mine. What? Man, never heard of Thieves Honor. Finders keepers, I was first. Listen, only one. Yeah, so in this friends. one you haven't met yet. This Brandon is the first time y'all meet. Fucked up. Either way, the ending's the same. I'm taking the car. What? What are you doing? Can you got us? I might have punched it. I might have just put my foot to the gas and peeled off. If you can, I know that was the option it said or whatever. Hands where I can see them. Nice and slow. Jackie Wells, my old pal from the hood. See you haven't grown an ounce wiser. Well, that's not hey. nice. Detective Stins. Been a while, huh? Inspector Stins. <laughs> Same shit. Speaking of, your mug's familiar too. Yeah? You zing to me. What is it the same thing? Left for Atlanta, looking for a slice of happiness. Guess you didn't find it. I've always maintained it's the Left same for, for all you termites in Haywood. Born here, live here, die here. Looks like I was right. You know, fuck all about me. Truth hurts, huh? Just watch your tone. I'm not a patient man. Hey, come on, Stint. Give us a break, huh? This is kind of tense. I just jerk off till trial. And then what? Worst case, we get some months. Hell, standing room only nowadays in El Bote. So, I'd probably be out early. Are these the thieves? Fuck Ordinary dear. street trash. Got him in custody, Mr. Fujioka. We'll be taking him now. Mr. Fujioka. It's a waste of effort. I have no time to testify or play it on an investigation. Suggesting we let him go, sir? I suggest you toss them in the sea. Oh, you the big I man, huh? Broken, so this One of them. Float. Got you. So he must have been paid or paid up with the cops. Fuck. Either protect his car or whatever. 
Got you. Oh shit. Oh shit. No! Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell Such an odd way for game by footage. You can tell that it's not an official CD Projekt Red release time. It's the brain dance, right? Okay, on you go. I've heard about Brain Dance a little bit and saw it in the uh in the stream. Money now or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God. Well yeah, hey now before I blow your fucking head off. That man is amped. Adrenaline is spiking, boy. Slow deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. I like her. You're alive and well. That was too much. Felt. I could feel the guy's pain, his stress, his hope. Hope wrapped up in something else. I wonder if we could romance Lizzie. Mm -hmm. Like, I wonder, like, the people you just can and can't. Is it everybody? You just have your pick in Cyberpunk? Just switch over to editing mode. Get whoever you want to? But anyway, we'll find out when the game comes out. Editing mode for brain dance. This is like the uh I'll sever the link to the BD rollers sensory array. You'll be able to look around freely. We'll see in the orbs. This is like full cam control and Arkham Knight detective mode, right? Kinda. In a way. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So analysis mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Mm -hmm. Then you use the editor console to unpause. Try it. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash. Like obviously, I know it's. To those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it. Got it. I know it's a lot more complicated well, than detective mode. Maybe more complex, but rewind, whatever you like. similar concept. Give it a try. Rewind. Roll it back to the top. All good, neat. Now try fast forwarding a bit. Plan simple. Do nothing on the creep. You go in, such cash. Yeah. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Hmm. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first About six minutes left. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Focus on the heat, the gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. I wonder why you have to do this. Is like a tutorial thing early? Like just showing you how to use brain dance? So I'm assuming it'll come in handy later. But for this, in analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. That's pretty this cool. This tech records everything, every little detail, even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. That's pretty to cool. See the sources of the recorded sensory signals. Switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. That's nuts. Now this is getting interesting for me. Case of and a of okay, we have a deal today on two flavors: Cuddy and uh, Serpent. Everybody, on the... so any thoughts? Unbelievable. Seriously, like what's happening right next to me. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks, them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sound, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Yeah, so this seems like more of a what tutorial a version for brain dance. Money. And then you'll Sometimes use you it later on. Extra layers in the raw. Stuff the roller is cyberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared, meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh. Hella nice. Hella. Marks on peaks too. 
saying hella in 2077, huh? Hella made it. Next thing, scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a nut injection. Or I will fucking drop you. I swear to God. Well, I'm gonna take no fucking head off. About to get popped. Bow. See that? They shot him, and he never saw it come. Now, where's the person? My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision. Then scan it. Hmm. Yeah, I can see how this would be real effective in the game for investigations. Probably planned to all along. Crime stuff. Nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. I like it. At first I was kind of like, eh, a little tedious, somewhat boring, but nah, I like it. It's, it's interesting now. Too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the law. <laughs> Flogging the log. I love this town. The city of endless opportunity. Then back to the trailer again. Cherry popped? Yeah, come on. City like any other. Just why not? No, Let it roll. Not just any other city. Legends are born here. The major leagues. We're only here because Dex is pulling the strings. Doubt that puts us in the same league as them. But we are. They just don't know it yet. But if you got the Spunky monkey. I just saw that. You could do damn near anything. So this looks incredible. I'm, I'm Even then, you go on PS5. Back. This is going to be nuts. And Xbox yeah, Series X too. It's going to look really good and run really good. So what's the gig, Dex? You meant to come out in one piece? <laughs> <laughs> How about we go over the plan? There's this prototype tech, a biochip to be precise. November 19th. Yes, it belongs to a court. Mm -hmm. Arasaka. We are robbing some heavy hitters. We're playing this a lot, man. How risk, how reward. First rule of the afterlife. Cut team, baby. Goes without saying, we do this. See, that looks much better with the car. Doing the donuts, the handle, and it's tight to the ground. Sounds simple enough. The weight of it, I like it. I can't wait to feel it though. To just be able to play it and get the game in my hands. God damn it. What the fuck just happened in there? Can't stop digging night city. Fucking major leaks. Happy now, Jackie. I just saw it was a grenade launcher out of his wrist or his arm. Oh my god, we're so fucked. Alright. 2077. Game risk could be. And you. Who are you? Fuck. Oh right, we didn't see Johnny Silverhand either in the gameplay footage, but that'll, that'll come later. We know he's in the game. Well, there we go. It was good to see some actual gameplay this time. It was a lot of gameplay. Uh, odd cuts though, but whatever. It was B-roll footage, so how it was cut up for people using it and uploading it online. Whatever. We got what we got. It was nice to get it. It's better than nothing. That's the main thing. It's better than nothing. Uh, like what I saw. Uh, the driving was good to see driving. Good to see nighttime. Uh, the verticality of the game, the details in the city as she's just flying around is nuts. Um, what else did we see? The Mantis Blade saw some of that cutting the head off. <laughs> um, nice to see the different paths too. Uh, as far as Nomad, Corpo, and Street Kid, like obviously you got the the feel of being a corporate dude, being up in the air and in the, the, the the airborne vehicles, and kind of being a dick as far as the decisions you can choose, uh, as far as the uh, conversational pieces. And different uh, stuff you could choose to say, which I'm pretty sure it changes depending on what you pick too. Like if you're a street kid, no matter corporal or what have you, there'll be special little things you could say depending on who you are in the world. So that'd be interesting to see how far that goes and the uh, the consequences it makes. Nomad being outside the city, having to drive in, uh, street kid stealing stealing cars. It's just it's a lot. It's a lot. There's gonna be a lot in this game to go through. I don't even know how people can review this game because there's so much stuff. Like, how are people gonna review it? How are you gonna put out a review for a game 
because you're gonna have to play it like four or five times to really get your feel of the whole thing but anyway that's not for me it's not my job uh what else what else did i notice that i really like to um hmm. oh jackie i like that it seems like no matter what path you pick you're gonna meet jackie jackie's in your life he just comes in at different points and different ways in your life depending on what you picked between the three paths um but yeah I, there's not much else to say like i'm super hyped for the game I, I i don't know how much more i can get excited for the game at this point unless they show just wildly different stuff that we haven't seen like net running i really want to see what's up with net running more advanced hacking like all this stuff was in the beginning of the game i've read it's not too super deep we haven't seen too much story stuff not much not a lot of it but little bits um yeah i want to see more of the skill tree that's another thing i did want to see some more of that the skill tree to see what we can customize and all that stuff but we will we will eventually uh brain dance is cool like i said initially i watching it, i was kind of like ah, i mean yeah, i hope we don't have to do it too much seemed a little bit boring a little tedious but um, as they kept unraveling it i get it it's cool it, it's interesting i'm into it depending on why we have to use it and how much I don't want to be using it having all the time, like, oh, you got to brain dance again, then do it again and do it again, because that would get a little tedious for me. But as far as like a special thing in the game that you do from time to time to help you out with stuff or to help you find uh, maybe new ways to enter a building before you do a mission, like little secretive stuff, uh, certain guns to hack. Oh, okay, you got that gun on you because I brain danced and saw you had it on you over here and you got it now, nah, yada, 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 yada. So it'd be interesting. November 19th, I'm sure we're going to have a whole lot more coverage and footage from CD Projekt Red from now until then, and also for me, we're doing videos with news stuff, breaking down different things, but enough talking, I've talked long enough, it's a long video as is, so that's it for the video, I do hope you guys enjoyed it, if you did, feel free to like it and subscribe to the channel, there's always much more content on the way, and I'll see y'all later.